All right. Just saddled up Justice. Get a little grooming first. I didn't throw it on, but I just kind of introduced it like to his nose and put it on. Didn't do any any preliminary exercises, I guess you could say. And you can see the look on his face here. So this would be a really good evening to go for a ride, actually. It's super calm. Beautiful day. Anyway, I'm going to let him wear it, get used to it. I, uh, uh, I did put a um, session yesterday on Justice, and uh, it was it was windy, really windy, and he wasn't too thrilled, and saddle blanket was blowing off before I could get the saddle to him, so I just decided to wait until it calmed down a little bit. Anyway, I want to give him time to get accustomed to wearing his saddle again, so that's what we're doing today. Okay, I um, just have the camera hanging around my neck again. I'm sorry about the bad angle. The horse we're working with is Justice. And um, since he hasn't been ridden in a year, he's broke his news. Um, but we haven't ridden him since 2017, fall of 2017. I'm just making sure that he's accepting everything, and he is. Look at that look on his face there. Yeah, so. Got our, our rattle toys here. Everywhere, over his back. And letting it fall on the ground. There you go. Another rattle. He's complaining about having that bit in his mouth. So, you can see, we need to let him get used to this tack again. So, that's all we're doing here. And we're just going over the extreme basics. He knows all this stuff. <laughs> Big ol' yawn there. <laughs> anyway, he's a fun horse to work with. He's our baby. We got him as a yearling. He's out of Dressage Morgans in Big Timber, Montana. EMR Morgans. First horse I've had that can be in one lead in the front. And he can switch leads with his back legs without switching leads with his front legs. It's pretty amazing. I actually had a trainer work with him to get him to not do that so much kind of an awkward move when you're just trying to do normal things like move cows. <laughs> but you can you can definitely see his talent there for that dressage. I'd love to put him in training. I'd love to. I might be rich enough one of these days. <laughs> I might be dreaming. But he is, let's see, I think he's eight years old. So he's right in the prime of life. Morgans can often, they often stay healthy until they're 32, so. Not unusual. <laughs> he wants to bite that one. It does have a treat bag on the end. He says, that smells good. Yeah, that smells good. Alright, we're done with this. And I'll just show you how he behaves on the lunch line. Since that's all I'm doing right now. <clears throat> I'm just getting him ready to ride. <clears throat> I have a whole bunch of horses over there. Three other big geldings. I struggled my way on to the saddle the other day and had a little ride on my 
little old mare. The rest of them, I really don't. I don't feel up to it. Walk on. Walk. Walk on. Good boy. You can see how laid back this horse is. He, he, he tends to be very laid back. I've had him to two trainers now. Both of them cowboyed out more than we do. And he did come home uh, pretty worked up. Like he, you know, they, they've been working him. We, when we work, we like to be relaxed. Uh, we like to start and end on a really relaxed note because it's so easy to get um, energy out of these horses. It's just so easy. It's their default. So we want them to work uh, relaxed. That's our goal. And make sure that they're in tune with their rider. Not nervous, you know? Not being asked to do something they don't understand. That happens to me almost all the time. Just a different style of working with horses. And he did. Um, he came back fine, in good shape. So. Trot. Trot. Walk, 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 walk. He always does this. He swings his head, take a look at you. Like, are we still doing this? Some of my others don't do that. I go, wait, is this what we're still doing? Reverse! Ooh. Okay. Good job. Here we have Winchester. <clears throat> Winchester is half pony. Just grooming some of this dirt off of him. He's out of our Welsh pony stallion. And a grade paint mare that we rescued. Kept her going as long as she could. She had a badly injured a chronic injury on her um, one of her rear hooves that just continued to get worse every single winter. But got three nice colts out of her. She was a really nice cross with our stallion. Very nice. What are you guys doing over there? <clears throat> My mares are bullying the two-year-olds. What's going on? Are you okay? Is Winchester okay? He not getting bullied. He's sensitive, but he's super fun. He's got a mm, kind of a bright outlook on life, I'd say. Um, just. Fairly laid back. But um, he is sensitive. So, over we go. Groom the other side. Come here. This, this year, this is funny. <laughs> See what he did? He took a step back there. Hi there. Hi, we're on this side now. This year, he, he's the same thing as Justice. He hasn't been ridden last year. Gonna get him ridden this year. And, um, 
So he was telling me at first he didn't like that that curry girl. But keep that thing away from me. Didn't like the spray bottle. Good boy. Good boy. <clears throat> Very dirty. Go over here and look at the colts, little babies. Blue's getting a drink. And looking through the fence at me. Can you see her? Hi there, baby. I can't remember her name. Fiona. It's Fiona. The other one. Her mommy's her mama's name is Charmed, I'm sure. And so my niece and my sister named her for me. They named her Lucky Charm. She's huge. She's gonna be just as tall as her mama before long. There's Fiona. And then over here, over there, sorry about the camera, oh, I don't like me zooming, got my two-year-olds, that one's full sister to Lucky Charm, her name's Cherry, and the other one's full sister to Fiona, Ebony, and there they are. Okay, saddle on. This one, of course, is Winchester. Saddle on. We just threw it right on. We're just gonna walk him out a little. And he has really needed to go over his fundamentals too, just from groundwork. I'm just getting him ready to ride also. Just reviewing things. Getting him used to wearing his saddle. I'll leave it on a little while after this lesson. Trot. Okay, he's reacting a little bit to the whip sound. So we'll just work on that just a little bit here. He's doing pretty good. He's watching me. His ears are twitching a little. Good boy. That was nice. Good. tossing noisemakers around. He has taken issue with my treat bag. <laughs> it's on an old buggy whip. He has taken issue with that. 
He's doing a lot better though. It's one of those things. I just want him to accept everything. And I don't know why. Some of them didn't get run through our bags and sacks and stuff. Some of them didn't get, uh, you know, we didn't spend that much time on this. We just kind of got on them and start riding. And I really want to get better used to uh, a flag too. We've since started just using a flag whenever we're training the youngsters. That works really good. They start accepting it pretty quickly. So that's Winchester. I really think he's ready to just hop on and ride too. He's probably wondering why I don't. <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.